Well, basically what we did was to, to uh, it's an introductory meeting with um, the board, the board members, the committee members and the staff and to have an open discussion as to the progress going on as is right now. And because of the pandemic, you know that, you know, we, there, there is nothing much happening, but then we want to start with the right, right foot to introduce ourselves with the staff and to find out what are some of the glitches they have within within the um, sports council. Um, not to mention that, you know, we, we have our board members that are that are well geared up. They are no strangers to, to, to the to society. They are very eloquent people and we, we are all ready to, to serve and to ensure that the development of sports continues. I know a lot of questions out there, you being the chair now, and when it comes to football in Toledo, I should say, and um, the relationship, what's the relationship going to be like with TFA, knowing that we know some members had, we should say, gave you some injustices in the past. What that is going to be like? Well, you know, to be, to be a professional, this is something that I have, I have been doing and some, a passion that I have loved about sports and the youth development. I am not particular about any individual that has anything against me. I am here for the development of sports because I know that we have talent here in Toledo. And for those that, that think that would have brought me down, I will work with them. I will work with them. I will show them the professionalism that we have and my team together. We, 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 will, we definitely will work with them. I want to mention, however, that they will not have their way the way they think that they would have done it. We are prepared to the, for the development of sports. We are prepared to develop the youth. We are prepared to work with everybody. It's not about Jose Tewol anymore. This is about the sports within country. And we, we want to instill and enhance discipline within the youth program. Well, just to supplement what my chair said earlier is that um, there are a lot of discipline in the Toledo district that are not being utilized. However, there are a lot of finances under the Spoke Council itself or under the ministry that, that are geared towards different uh, discipline. For example, with the current regulation and the pandemic, COVID-19 pandemic, we're, I mean, come on, look at it. We're, we're at zero sporting activities right now. When you're capable of having uh, table tennis, for example, table tennis is a, is a very good venture. If you look at it, you have competitions. A very good friend of mine, uh, Tyron Tun, he went all the way to Taiwan to represent Belize as part of a uh, table tennis competition. And he and, and has made Belize on the map. And it seems that it's only confined to, you know, um, Belize City and the high, where you call more developed uh, parts of the country. And I think that is something where during this time we need to cap on that. You know, and then we have the volleyball um, where you could do three. You might not have the support of everyone, but you are getting the young. You have to start develop the young. Uh, the young population into practicing and continue doing what they love. You understand? So whenever this pandemic is lifted or w whenever the regulations allow us to do, then we're already ahead of the game. You understand? So, so those are things that I want to cap to. Um, there are other stuff, for example, like chess, you know, like table games that we could, that we could work with around the uh, regulations that are currently in place. So we just have to wait until those moments are right for us. And it's an opportune name now for us as the, um, the new committee to actually sit down. I mean, yes, it's, it's trying times for us, but it gives us a lot of opportunity to actually sit down and decide and discuss and, and come up with new in, you know, innovative ideas as how we could move. So when all these are lifted and we're free to go, then you know, we're a step ahead. We could just implement what we've already planned.